so pretty. Nails, hair, tan, all honey, brows. Ah, this needs work. Are you gonna come with me? Let's do this. Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Sarah and I am so grateful to have each and every single one of you here to join me in a brand new video. This is my glow up transformation. You don't always have to look so glam, but if you want to look put together, but mostly, most importantly, you're doing it for yourself, there is nothing wrong with that. Whether it's working out, whether it's making your favorite latte and feeling so good drinking it or getting your nails done and it just makes me feel good and at the end of the day yes it's important to feel good on the inside but for me it's like when i have a nice tan I'm like yeah you're looking good you're looking like nice and fit so if you guys want to know how i got looking like this which i still love looking like this there's nothing wrong with that to looking like this Then, please keep watching. First step is eyebrows. So, I am going to fill in my eyebrows first because I recently did a how to do my bushy brow tutorial and if I clean up my eyebrows, it's just a necessary thing to do because I don't want to over tweeze or over pluck or whatnot. So, you guys get it, but I'm going to actually do this off screen because again, I just did a video. If you guys want to watch, you're more than welcome to. I really hope that you guys will enjoy that one as well, but I will be right back. You guys will see a difference. It's like, oh, night and day. Okay, so they're not perfect, but I honestly don't intend them to be perfect as in like filling them in. I just wanted to kind of have a guideline is what I'm trying to say. I'm gonna take one of these blades. I'm sure you guys have seen these before. I don't like to use them all over, but just a little bit, like right. You have to be careful with this because it's very, very sharp. It's just gonna take some little fuzzies, some little fuzzies. So when you use a blade like this, you kind of have to like hold and really get close and like lift, but it's kind of hard for me to see through through right here. So I'm just gonna do that part off, but I'll show you guys afterwards. I'm just gonna do like right here, just right there. You guys will see the difference. So this little thing helped me a lot, but just doing that little thing just did wonders honestly and i already feel a lot better because i feel more put together you know i don't have any strays and yeah so let's move on to next step okay so we are in the bathroom <laughs> and i think it is so important to you know prep your skin before you tan and i obviously want to do this before i take a shower because in the shower i'm going to shave and then i'll show you guys the hair treatment that i'm going to be using for my hair so it all kind of you know it needs to start from here because i want to take care of my face first so i want to take all of this off because my eyebrows are obviously now nice and clean and i'm going to be using this la roche Posse. this is a new one i actually just picked this up it's a cleanser for oily skin and I do have oilier skin, especially in the T-zone. Um, so I wanna take care of that. And then I wanna use this bad boy. I actually reviewed this on my channel and I truly, truly love this. And I do find a difference when I do use this. There's just a few things though, is that you just have to make sure, make sure your skin is nice and dry, nice and clean before using this. So this is why I'm going in with this first. So let's get started. Now it's time for Yo Glow. So again, make sure your skin is nice and dry. So your so is your hands, and that should be good. Oh, 
so my skin feels nice and polished i feel nice and clean and i just want to take a shower but obviously before i do because i can't take you guys with me i want to let you guys know the hair mask that i am going to be using i'm obsessed with this and my hair needs this so bad right now you guys i'll show you guys my hair in a sec it is just the hairstyle that i did which is just mousse and i crunched it up after a few days it just looks really frizzy and i always tend to use this step especially when i have just done a hairstyle like this and it is the Catastase. This is, I believe, for color treated. And I didn't color my hair probably early, early last year, actually. But there's still dye in it. But this is pretty much my natural hair color. But it's still such a wonderful mask. And it makes your hair feel like butter. And I need that, especially after this. So I'm going to show you guys what my hair looks like. I'm sure you guys saw it a little bit in the beginning of the video. But this is what I'm dealing with. So my hair naturally is curly, but I mean, when I first mousse it up, it looks so nice. But then after a few days, I mean, this is, I mean, I don't mind this. I mean, this is perfect for like a beach or whatnot, but just in general, you know, it's just such a low maintenance hairstyle and I was just lazy that day and I just wanted to do it. But you know, you can tell just how dry my ends are and this stuff is amazing. So I really can't wait to use this, but I want to show you guys also in the shower, I'm gonna do a nice scrub. And it's just a cloth and it's a nice scrub before I shave and it really exfoliates the skin and of course after shave and then I'll be all ready to do my tan. So I will be back, I will see you guys shortly. So I am back, I just finished taking a shower and oh, if like my hair, I know it's wet and it's like, okay, yeah, of course it's gonna look shiny, but you'll see after, it's just so good. And before I actually brush my hair, I just use this. This is the Ketastas for unruly hair. So this has heat protectant in it and it actually just makes me brushing my hair out a lot easier. And I just got this brush, this Moroccan oil, and it is really, really good. It's their paddle brush. I'm just gonna dry my hair and I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm just joking. Whew. Okay, so now that I finished drying my hair, it's time to self tan. This is one of my favorite things to do. I just feel good and ugh, it's such a transformation. I truly believe in that. Anyways, I'm gonna be using two different products. I'm gonna be using the Dolce by Isabel and I'm gonna be using the Bondi Sands Arrow and Ultra Dark. I'm not gonna lie, I was at Shoppers Drug Mart and this was on sale and I still really love this. So this is what I'm gonna be using. Also, this is almost done and I know for sure I would not have enough to do the whole body. So I just am going to leave this specifically for the face because I wouldn't put this on my face. I've done it before and I think it just clogs pores and it's not necessarily this specific product. It's just a mousse in general. This is way better for your face and this has really good ingredients. So this is just great in general. So until this gets back in stock, because I don't know if I mentioned this was out of stock. That's the reason why I haven't gotten it or gotten a replacement yet. So. These are two products I'm gonna be using. I've already prepped my skin and I put lotions on where I need to. And now it's time for the fun to begin. I'm gonna do my face first. This is such a transformation. Like, cool. I'm showing you guys a different side of me. But hey, you know, girls know you do this too. Look guys, can't get the hair, you know, looking tanned. Guys, I cannot even begin to tell you how amazing that smells. Oh, it smells so good. Okay. So your girl's looking nice and golden. I am back. I'm wearing my infamous shirt that I tan in. It's been on my channel many, many times. But this is a true, authentic glow. This is what I would use when I tan. <laughs> so anyways, my plan now is to grab some water, set up my little nail section, and do my nails because these are just these are not gonna cut it. I need my nails done. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do some gel nails, some gel polish, I should say, not gel nails. And then I will see you guys tomorrow because I'm gonna let this sit because it's only been a couple minutes and I want a nice deep tan and the next day will look so much better. And then I'll do a mini glam moment. 
for this and then I will fix my hair and that will be the end of this transformation. So let's go get our nails done. I'm so excited. I'm excited for every step. Like I always say, oh, this is my favorite. No, they're all my favorite. <laughs> Good morning everyone. So it is officially the next day. I just got ready and I'm gonna start my day pretty much but I want to do my hair and my mini glam and I obviously took a shower. This is my tan. It doesn't look as dark now and or actually from the camera you can't really tell but it's a nice color and this is exactly what I wanted. So anyways I'm gonna speed this up. If you guys want a specific video dedicated on this makeup look comment down below but other than that I will speed this up because you guys have seen me do makeup on my channel so many times. So let's get started. So this was the final result for this glow transformation. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Again, if you want any specifics on the hair or the makeup, just comment down below, let me know. And again, I have tons of makeup tutorials. I'm planning on doing more, maybe a spring makeup look. Let me know if you guys wanna see that. Comment down below. I'm so happy that you guys were here to join me. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way you are aware when a new video comes out. I love you guys so much.